Hi everyone, uh, second attempt, first battery run down so I'm doing this video again. This is a little rant, okay, fortunately I don't have as many rants as I do have videos on the telephones or the lamps or the plants, but occasionally I do feel it that I do need a rant and probably warn other people who are going to make a big mistake, which I did, by buying this upright, self-powered vacuum cleaner. Can I call it that? It's not the word I would normally use. Anyhow, I bought this item oh, a while back. It's been in storage, really. It's, in my opinion, it's not very good. This has the uh, head which does up the stairs and you've got your battery pack. As you can see it's made by a company called Shark which I understand were quite good makers but unfortunately this model which I think it's a few years old in my opinion is useless. Now I own as a lot of you know a pussy cat and in owning a pussy cat you have to look after them and my one has a dirt box which it can do its business in the pieces of material a little white crystal like things um, and they do get mixed slung about in the room obviously when the cat uses the box some of the 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 uh, stuff comes out anyway what I'm trying to say is that in the kitchen where the box is it has to be regularly vacuumed to get rid of them and normally I use this big brute I am you um, which I bought a while back um, which is fine it has replaceable paper bags which you can put in and change when it fills up it's powerful enough and it's one I use perhaps 90% of the time when I do the vacuuming and it sucks up the stuff and gets rid of it so that, as far as I'm concerned that works and um, it is good. Hyundai is the name I think. It is a Korean firm but this one was actually made in China as loads of other things are. Anyway that's another story. I've got no problems with this. This works fine. Anyhow getting back to the other one which I'm talking about. Yeah. Um, the if it is expected to pick up tiny amounts of dirt, when I say tiny amounts of dirt, mainly a bit of cat hair, a bit of fluff, okay. It will pick up the little white crystals out of the dirt box. Now these crystals are not ones that have been are dirty, they're clean they're dry and they just scatter on the floor so you try and pick them up using this head which I'm showing now and as I said before it picks up tiny amounts of dirt I'll say the odd bit of fluff the time it is jammed up inside is more or less every time it collects the dust in the top here. It's just bad design, really bad design. Before the fluff gets into the collecting box or the dirt box, it has jammed up. And often than not, where this joint is here, which is used to lower it so it gets under things, that often jams up as well. So you end up half the time cleaning out the um, pipe. Anyhow, that's not all. 
after vacuuming up the time has come to turn it off. That's when the fun starts. As soon as you turn the motor off or stop it working, trouble starts. Stuff that has collected in the head, this part here what we're looking at, doesn't get drawn up into the dirt container and as soon as you turn it off it presents you with all the rubbish back onto the floor. This has happened to me several, well every time I use this, this machine as far as I'm concerned it is absolute rubbish and one place for this is the dustbin. I wouldn't even put it on eBay, I wouldn't have the cheek to put it on eBay so someone else buys this product which in my opinion is absolutely useless. Anyhow that's all I've got to say so let me see what you comments you make. Some of you might have bought one of these and said it's a marvellous machine. I don't know what kind of dirt you've got but I've got what is proper dirt normal household dirt which it doesn't pick up and it doesn't work. Anyhow that's all I've got to say. Thanks for listening and um, okay I can recommend certainly not this item but the other one I showed which is that one over there I can recommend that they seem to be quite good reasonably priced as well also on eBay. I might add that this one came off of eBay. It was um, a second-hand job. It was reconditioned by, uh, I don't know, by a company. I can't remember which one. But it was reconditioned. And it, as I say, it came in perfect condition. But it doesn't work. So if anyone's thinking about getting one of these, <laughs> my opinion is don't. Try it out. Anyhow, thanks for watching. Thank you. Any comments, please make. Thank you.